This video will be the patterns for a burst, trellis veil, stole, and maniple in inches. Set into your patterns by using a T-square and checking the angles. For the burst, the side panel is four and a half inches by nine and a half inches, and the main pot is nine and a half inches by ten and a quarter inches down with the cross placement four and three quarter inches up from the edge that is to be stitched. The matting is eight and a half by eight and a half inches. The chalice veil is 24 inches by 24 inches and a three or four inch cross is centered three and a half inches from the bottom. The stole is 43 and a half inches long. The top is two and three quarter inches across with a half inch extension and then angled. We'll come down the pattern 35 and a half inches and it will angle to four and a half inches across. Then 39 inches down, 39 and a half, sorry, inches down will be seven and a quarter inches across. And the bottom will be eight inches across and it'll be 43 and a half inches down. The cross is centered three and a half inches from the bottom. On the maniple, the maniple is 20 and a quarter inches long. The top line will be three and three quarter inches across. Then come down 12 and a quarter inches and it'll be four inches across. Come down 16 and a quarter inches and it'll be seven and a quarter inches across. Come down 20 and a quarter inches and it'll be eight inches across. Center the cross three and a half inches from the bottom. Now for the curve, using a flexible measuring tape, curve it on each side and it will be eight and one quarter inches. Just take the tape and go around the edge. And that's it.